Hi there, and welcome back to the M5 Stack official channel. I'm Luke, and in this video, we're going to be taking you through the top 10 M5 Stack products of 2019. Now, if you've been watching this channel for a while, you should be familiar with what M5 Stack is. For the uninitiated, however, M5 Stack is a stackable modular development kit based on the ESP32 chip developed by Espressive Systems. However, recently there have been other products in the M5 Stack line that use other chips than the ESP32. The M5 Stack system starts from cores, which are core units which can be extended from with various stackable devices and also a series of peripherals containing cameras, keyboards and so on. Now we'll have a countdown of the top 10 best-selling M5 Stack products of 2019 and some projects related to those. Starting off at number 10, we have the M5 Stack Camera or PS RAM Cam as it's often known. It comes in a nice case which has LEGO compatible holes so you can attach it to any of your LEGO projects or the units in the M5 Stack series. Comparing it to other cameras in the M5 Stack range, we can see that it has 4 megabytes of extra PS RAM that the other cameras don't have. This gives it that extra processing power to capture higher frame rate video and also higher quality images. Moving on to number 9, we have the Card KB unit. The Card KB is a flat PCB QWERTY keyboard with a growth connector to connect it to the I2C port of any of the M5 stack devices. This comes in handy for typing in passwords or commands into any of your M5 stack programs, or using it as a controller for games. Next up, we have the Proto module. Regardless of the fact that we have many stacks, including many different types of hardware and functionality, we know that many engineers want to develop their own custom solutions. So in order to make it easier, we develop this stack in the same form factor as other stacks, but with a Proto board inside where you can solder your own circuits or ICs and combine it with your other stacks for all kinds of projects. The Proto range now also includes two different types of prototyping units and a prototyping stick hat. In at number 7 we have the ESP32 cam, a low cost ESP32 based board suitable for adding vision to your various M5 stack projects. Take this project for instance, this YouTuber Dr. ZZS shows you how to make a smart home doorbell system using Home Assistant and the ESP32 Home project. In this video he shows you how to add a touch capacitive button and use various functions of the camera for monitoring your home. In at 6 we have the M5 Go. The M5 Go is an M5 stack device which was designed with a STEM education field in mind. It also introduced the unit system a series of expandable sensors which can be attached by the common growth standard. It features a Lego base, RGB LEDs on the side and three growth compatible ports. The production of the M5 Stacks M5 Go also gave birth to the UIFlow programming interface. UIFlow is a block based programming language which allows seamless transition between connecting hardware and programming it in software, allowing kids and people from a non tech background to get started in programming their ideas. Next up is the Faces Development Kit. The Faces Kit is a base that allows you to mount the M5 stack module with various different faceplates offering different functionalities. Today, the Faces series includes seven different types of faceplates, including calculator, keyboard, gamepad, fingerprint sensor, RFID, encoder, and joystick. The gamepad is perfect for playing games on an emulator or even developing your own games with such tools as the RG Boy library. 
Some users have even combined Raspberry Pi Zero with their Faces kit to make a pocket Linux system. In at 4, we have the M5 Stack Fire. The M5 Stack Fire is enhanced version of the M5 Go. If we compare the two, we can see that the M5 Stack Fire has extended PS RAM. This allows us to do more processor heavy stuff, such as playing GIFs or streaming live video. There's some nice projects on the Hackster.io page for M5 Stack, which include programming the M5 Stack Fire with the moddable JavaScript SDK, or this camera project, which allows you to connect an M5 Stack camera to the M5 Stack Fire device, take a picture, which is then overlaid with a black and white filter, and then sent over Wi-Fi to another M5 Stack Fire connected to a thermal printer. In at 3, we have the M5 Stick V, the first M5 Stack device not to use the ESP32. It uses the K210 Kendrite RISC-V chip. This device was built purposely for AI projects, specifically machine vision, using neural networks to process images. Some notable projects include Brownie's image recognition library, which will allow you to recognize various objects, and then it will speak them out in Japanese. This can be modified for any language though. The V-Training website can be used to take photos of various objects and then create models to train the camera to recognize them. Another user created a nice project which can recognize various facial expressions and emotions. In at number 2 we have the Stick c The Stick c is a pine-size ESP32 device which includes an accelerometer, I.O. remote, microphone and many other functions. It could be combined with a strap to make a smart watch. The cool projects include a slot machine, various remotes for cameras, miniature robots, and even smart glasses. And now for number one, the product that started the M5 stack revolution off, the core or basic M5 stack. Why is this device still so popular? It's likely that this compact package includes everything an ESP32 developer needs to get started creating their own applications. It has the three buttons, a screen, a single growth port, and the male and female GPIO pins laid out clearly on the bottom. Although it lacks the extra RAM of the other devices and doesn't include an accelerometer, it still takes the top spot and people have used it to create everything from oscilloscopes, to weather stations, to wireless radios, and so on. That's it for our top 10 today. We really appreciate your support for M5 Stack products, and we hope to continue to make great products for you in the future. If you like this video, make sure to click the like button, subscribe so you can see new videos from M5 Stack, Leave a comment if you have any suggestions for M5 Stack. And all of the projects in this video will be listed down in the descriptions. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.